Hello. <coughs> oh. Hello, guys, and welcome to Dennis Day playing on a brand new series. Uh, this is... Oh, look at that. This is map making for my uh, upcoming personal mod pack. Uh, I'm making a new mod pack because I thought it was so much fun. And in this mod pack, we are also setting up a story quest and th that kind of stuff. And uh, we're also going to make a um, story to accommodate what is, hap uh, what is happening here. Um, I think we should take a sleep. Okay. Now. What I'm going to do in this series is I'm going to create a map or a world uh, in creative, which is going to be featured in my um, mod pack. I don't think that's too bad, is it? Uh, so what I'm kind of thinking about is um, having this be kind of a uh, fishing ruined village. Uh we also have this structure over here. I'm I, I'm in I'm in my mod pack right now. Um, it still has a lot of work to do. I still have quests to add. Um, let's see if we type HQM. Um, HQM enable. Oh, whoops. I didn't mean to do that. Oh well. Um, HQM edit. Uh, the world has risen up to all its glory, but a all-out war has left you the lone survivor in this world, and you have to you have to rebuild this land. Follow the quests and grow the technology back. And. Um, this is the quest so far. You have wooden, sto uh, wooden start, uh, cobblestone, um, gravel bits, clay monster, which uh, requires you to collect six 64 clay and kill five zombies and three sheep. Uh, then you have Tinker's Construct, where you build these guys and you get a little bit of something for the smelt rate. And then we have the um, thermal tank, which gives you lava bucket and or a quartz grindstone or a crusher. You have to pick one. So that is actually pretty cool uh, so far. Uh, I just got to figure out the rest. So what we are doing is we are going to build. Uh, so let's see. Spruce. Um, marble, maybe. Uh, I'm thinking, why not? No, not that one. Um, I'm kind of wanting to, but I'm kind of not wanting to, you know? Uh, let's go with a little bit of bricks and a little bit of cobblestone, okay? And this will be your starting house. It'll be a little bit out in the water, so we're actually going to need a little bit of dirt as well. Because uh, I think that I want to build it out a little bit. So let us go... Uh, night... Vision? Because why not? That way we can actually see what we're doing on water. Uh, my resource pack, I could have used it, but I'm not going to. I'm mostly thinking. Uh, the grass will probably despawn, unfortunately. Uh, not much I can do about that, though. Uh, so there we go. And uh, maybe out to here? I'm thinking. Great thing about using 
this is you will see uh, the border border of where you were putting stuff down. You know. And we have some extra sounds, which I think is great. Uh, ambient sounds is amazing. There. We don't need to make it any more shallow, so to speak. And I chose this bomb because it's pretty. Uh, this is the kind of stuff that I would actually like to do off screen. Uh, because, well, I would like to have this sort of stuff already out of the way. So we can just focus on building and not terraforming, you know. Uh, I don't know if terraforming is really exciting to watch, if you know what I mean. Uh, let's take this cross like one more, I think. There we go. And then we can go right here with... This. And that'll bring out like so. I think that's gonna be a whole lot better, at least. Whoops. a whole lot better, I think. Um, there we go. So my plan for this area uh, I'm, is to kind of make a village a sort of ruin for life. Uh, try to make it look like uh, something has been going down. Um, stuff aren't as good as they once were. Uh, so we're gonna also use a little bit of machine to get um, that that doesn't do much. Uh, like you don't have power, but machines are maybe somewhere. And I think that's gonna help us a lot. Let's see, what time is it? Okay, it's three o'clock. Uh, so I've been spending a couple of Minecraft days, uh, it starts at day 199, up in the left corner. It starts at day 199, um, but I have been kind of uh, fixing a few things, um, removing a little bit of stuff that we don't really need to have here. Um, I was thinking about removing that, but uh, maybe we could um, build it into some sort of uh, pyramid or something like that and rather make it a bit more interesting instead of uh, this kind of roof here. I see I need to remove a few things here as well. There's, there's two structures in one here. That's not good. But um, we will get to that later. Uh, now I want us to have a main base where we are going to be where the spawn point will be set for the world. Um, so I think we are gonna go in there. One, two, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. I think. And then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. And then we're just gonna go across to here, right there, actually. Then we're gonna go one, two, three, four, because that'll give us a five high ceiling. Or yeah.
and then take it across here. And then we can bring this across as well, because why not? And uh, I'm thinking that we are going to have some sort of a fireplace here. That's why I wanted the bricks. Uh, so I'm thinking that we are going to go... Oh. Like this. We could probably build it a bit bigger, to be honest. Uh, there, and there, there. One, two there and just bring this around instead. I will make it better. I just want a base. Um, this that'll go through there. Could probably shorten this one out then. Maybe something like that. Just maybe. Um, this is just the planning stages. Seven o'clock, we can sleep. Alright, so uh, then we will wake up at six. That is great. Um, then we're gonna go ahead and remove that bed. Just it's gonna be in the way. Um, I think that this is gonna be in the way as well. But um, we'll see. Actually, it's not. Okay, so this actually needs to be built out a little bit for us to have it inside uh, inside as well. There we go. And then we're just going to go ahead and set up the walls like this. Uh, this building isn't going to be too far away from uh, a vanilla building, but... Um, it's still gonna be a little bit different. And door right there. And if we search up door, we should be able to uh, left medium, left dark. I think we're gonna go with medium. Just because I think these doors are kind of pretty. We do have Melissa's door, so we could have made one of those types, but... I think it's okay to do it like that. Um, then we need to find a floor. And I'm kind of thinking... Something that might look a bit... Cracked up. Because this is... You know, it's kind of old. It's supposed to be a bit old, look a bit different. Um, so I'm thinking we're gonna search up brick. And we're not go gonna go with uh, any vanilla stuff. Uh, so I'm thinking... Maybe... Ooh, mossy cobblestone, actually. That could be neat. But no. No, no, no. Green concrete. What about... Cracked brownstone bricks? How would that look in here? No, that's not what I want at, at all. What if we search up slab and use them? These guys, these guys, and these guys. This I was kind of hoping to use on the path outside, so we're not going to be using that. No. Maybe we will just go with something simple. Uh, so if we search up slab again, uh, we should be getting... Maybe that one would work, and a little bit of that. Uh, maybe a little bit of that. Let, let's take a look at these. Uh, not that one. 
that one actually not so bad. I think we're gonna go with that. Because uh, it kind of looks like you've been painting and uh, you've been spilling some. And uh, I think that's okay. Now, I could use my tools, but then we would need to go into survival. You know what? We're gonna do it. Game mode zero. And we're gonna use the cobalt shovel because. I'm cleaning out the area. It's gonna be a bit faster than going the creative way. Oh. There. Thank you. Whoops. And that's a bit better, I think. Oh well. No more water on the inside, that's great. And uh, then I think we should have some stairs here. So I think we're gonna go like so. And let's see, slab. Oh, that can happen. Slab, and I'm thinking stone slabs as a stair, because why not? And we are probably gonna change out the cobblestone around here and uh, use something else, but um, for now I think it's okay. Maybe. Just maybe. Uh, let's see, we're gonna go there, there. And around we go, right? That's actually the height. And let's see, what kind of floor do we want to use up here? Uh, most likely some sort of slab. Uh, maybe actually spruce wood. Because um, it's, it doesn't look bad. You know? I do love me some spruce. There, and then we're going to go across like so. you want to be able to get up and down you know if i had placed a slab where i tried to place it we wouldn't be able to get a, uh, get up and down here right because you would just bump your head into this and we're gonna have some walls surrounding this stair so that it's actually a bit easier to get up and down and for that i want to use uh concrete and i'm thinking we will go for green maybe yeah, why not? Why not green? There. And we're gonna go like so. And a torch wouldn't be too bad. We don't need to use the book. There. And then we're gonna go with this slab again. just because we need to get this filled in, right? Maybe we will use concrete around here instead of cobblestone, actually. Because uh, cobblestone is kind of overused, sort of. I'm thinking green, just because green. Oh. Now, this is a van uh, th these blocks are mostly vanilla that I'm building with, but we will be using some modded uh, blocks later on. Because I have a few ideas how to implement some other kind of mods here. 
and um, well, seeing as we are using mods, why not build with them as well, you know? Uh, although I do love me the concrete from vanilla. I think it's fantastic. Um, and it's probably one of my favorite additions so far to Minecraft. Um, in newer times, of course. Uh, there we go. And filling up here. Okay, not bad, not bad at all. Um, let's see. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, we need to fix this. Uh, I need I need it to be as good as possible. Uh, so left and right. There we go. And now I want to kind of work a bit with um, uh, the walls to make it look a whole lot better. So let's use a little bit of that and um, let's see, does biomes of plenty, plenty have any sort of cubes. Where is Bams of Plenty, though? Tinker, RF tool, Tinker, 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 Applied Energistics. There we go. Because if they have any green planks or something, we can maybe um, work that into the wall here, I'm thinking. Because uh, why not? Planks were here. We have eth ethereal wood and willow wood, which are kind of green. I'm thinking this one would probably do the trick. Uh, and then we need some lighting in here. Um, we're gonna throw away that one. And this is just for now, you know. We will get something better later on, but, um,. For now, I think... Oh, sorry. Scratched the microphone. That can happen. Uh, let's see. How would it look if we were to kind of use a little bit of wood in here? And maybe actually a little bit of concrete powder would probably not be a bad idea. Uh, there, there, there. How does that look? Um, if we were to use a bit more of it, maybe. Um, no, I don't think so. I don't think we are going to be using wood in this. Maybe we could use some logs, uh, willow log, like going at a little bit like this, uh, there, there, maybe that would be better. Kind of think so, but... I did a fast one, but no. Concrete, green, thank you. There, there. Any better? A bit, yeah. I think I like that. Uh, we're also going to have windows, so... Don't worry about that bit. So, maybe something like so, just randomly punching through here, uh, 
and then we will add a bit of wood, a bit of logs, uh, there and there and there and there, maybe right there, 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 and then we're gonna go with uh, some powder in here, just texturizing, you know. We need something right there. Um, I will possibly also use something more. I just need to figure out what. Uh, if I put concrete down here, we will lose the powder and it'll become concrete because uh, the water activates the process of making the concrete. So that's kind of lame, but um, that's okay. There, and then... Like so, maybe. And it looks a bit better. Not 100%, and it's still a little box. I want to make it... I want to give it some shapes and uh, make it a bit more interesting. But at least we got something, you know? So let us start putting in some shapes. Uh, in this building. Uh, so what if we were to go, uh, let's say there, and up here, and then that was two blocks. One, two, there. And like so, so that we get a little bit something to work with instead. Then I'm thinking that we will go like so. Which means that this wall... Whoops. What was this? I'm not sure how to write this, so... Eucopolyptus would slap. Right there. That will take us around a little bit like this. Now this is more for uh, to make it look a bit better on the outside. This will probably not do as much good from a using point of view or what I'm supposed to call it. This is just purely for the looks outside. And already that is a whole lot better, right? So I think we're gonna do the same on the other side. Uh, no, we will not because of the chimney here. I think that's actually good enough. Uh, a little bit of shape and it is great. Um, we could do the same on this side though, but um, it's not gonna be, you know what, that's fine. It's okay to have it like that, I think. Uh, slab. this, because, um, there we go. The walls are gonna go up here, right? And there we go. Like so. So much better. Then we will need to do the same on this wall, to be honest. Uh, kind of texturizing it a little bit, uh, make it look a whole lot better, and that kind of stuff. So, I think we're gonna go with that one. Nope. There. 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 And I think that's good. Then it's just a little bit of concrete left. That looks like a face. <laughs> um, there. That's better, I think. Maybe we could even remove that one. Oh, didn't mean to do that. There. And maybe that one. 
Okay, that that didn't look random. That looked like a shape. I don't want shape. Uh, so there. And that should maybe be a bit better. There. Yeah, that's better. It's a lot better. Okay, we have the start of a house here. And that is awesome. Uh, just gotta remove that one. Uh, gonna get out this dude and replace the ground right here. And then I also want to have windows in this uh, building. So what I'm thinking about is that we're gonna go with uh, clear glass from Tinker's Construct. There. 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 This will probably help us out a little bit with a few things, actually. Uh, let's go on the outside and go there and maybe there. Okay. We have some windows. Awesome. And this looks a bit better than it did first off. Uh, this is a whole lot better it... Um, this is a whole lot better than what it would have been with uh, cobblestone instead. And that pleases me. So what I also want to do uh, before we finish the episode is... Did I throw a... Okay, I have a bed. I want to throw in a couple of trees here. I want some trees go, uh, going here. I want a little bit of different uh, outward look. So we need a few things to make that happen. Uh, let's see, we're gonna need bone meal, and what was the last, oh yeah, coarse dirt, okay, so we are gonna go into, that game mode, and we are going to, uh, kind of, uh, path out here, so it'll look a bit different as well. So, then we are going to go with uh, the bricks that we were looking at earlier, and uh, we'll also implement that into this. There we go. Uh, then we will go maybe a little bit like this. Uh, I'm kind of wanting to have a little bit of pot soil as well, but uh, we also need for dirt. Um, there we go. There we go. Then we can kind of throw down a little bit of dead bushes around here. Um, we can throw down a little bit of these guys. And... Um, Like so, maybe? Grow a couple of these up a tad bit. So they are kind of tall. Uh, making it look like... Um, like so. This dude we don't need. Any flowers we get, we don't really need to keep them. Because uh, there are lots and lots of flowers here. So, where we kind of build and change out a bit, we don't need to take, you know, we don't need to keep any flowers. We could, we probably will, but yeah, this is mostly how it's going to look. Uh, maybe add a few um, of these guys. Maybe not right there, though. Because uh, we need to get up and down. So we are going to have these guys instead. Right? And that is the beginning of the base. Uh, where you will spawn and uh, hopefully have lots and lots of fun. Uh, we could probably 
turn off time. But that is that world spawn. Now you should be spawning on this block. Let's actually place it right there. Oh, it was right there. Okay. Because uh, um, this house you are going to be using. Uh, if you pl uh, decide to play with this world, which I hope, because the story will be built around this world. Uh, so, with that in mind, I bid you all farewell for now. And I will see you guys in the next episode. I hope you guys enjoyed this one. If you did enjoy it, don't forget to hit the like button. Don't forget to subscribe if you want to see more videos like this. And um, other than that, have an awesome day. And I will see you guys in the next episode. Okay. Bye-bye.